welcome to teddy physics today we are going to discuss about inner exercise 1 chapter 10 electricity what does an electric circuit means it is a question we are having now first question so a continuous and closed path of an electric current is called an electric circuit then this circuit consists of electrical devices so what does this meaning we will discuss in a diagram mode more so here we are having an electrical circuit i am going to draw it so in our real life we are using fans right so in these circuits we are not going to draw real fans but we are going to draw fans in terms of resistors r1 and acs are load containing devices we will draw in terms of resistors only and if you are having capacitors we are using capacitors and that we will draw in terms of capacitors and in order to complete the circuit we need a source which will power all the devices i am going to draw the source also here so this is source which is having voltage v and uh, since from the current will flow from positive terminal to negative terminal so this is the direction of the current and uh, let me take this is r1 r2 and c1 with the capacitance so a continuous and closed path of electric current is called an electric circuit so the electric current is continuously flowing in a closed path okay and this path having electrical devices like r1 r2 capacitance this kind of devices and source is also electrical devices so this total we can say it as an electric circuit an example of electric circuit this is it now second question define unit of current so what is unit of current actually what is current now actually current is equal to charge per unit time so rate of flow of charge we can call it as current so SI unit of current is ampere ampere is the SI unit of current so what does one ampere mean that is it so unit of uh, current is ampere that we know so what does one ampere meaning so one ampere meaning is nothing but one coulomb of charge coulomb of charge per one second so flow of one coulomb of charge per one second gives one ampere so this is the unit of uh, current ampere one coulomb per one second okay. so that is unit of current third question more calculate number of electrons consisting one coulomb of charge constituting So in one coulomb of charge how many electrons will be there that is the question we are asking so first of all one electron is equal to how much charge 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 coulombs then how many electrons will give one coulomb of charge this is the question they are asking so let me take this is the equation one and this is equation two and uh, i'm going to do equation one by equation two now so equation 1 divided by 2 but do you like this so what will come on? so that implies so 1 electron divided by n which is nothing but 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 coulombs divided by n 1 coulomb so 1 electron is equal to 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 coulomb and n electrons is equal to 1 coulomb equation 1 divided by equation 2 so here units I will get cancelled coulomb coulomb will get cancelled here so one electron is equal to 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 times of n because here n is doing division if it goes this side multiplication 
So in this part 1.6 in 10 power minus 19 is doing multiplication if it comes this side and this division. So 1 by 1.6 into 10 power minus 19 times of electron is equal to n. And if you solve this one and we will get here as 6.25 into 10 power 18 electrons is equal to n. So meaning what? Meaning that 1 coulomb of charge has how many electrons? 6.25 into 10 power 18 electrons. So think about current ma. Think about current. So one ampere indicates what? One ampere indicates what? So one coulomb of uh, charge per one second. Meaning what? 6.25 into 10 power 18 electrons has to cross the unit. Uh, has to cross in one second. So if you take one point. So, how many electrons has to cross this one point? 6.25 into 10 to 10 power 18 electrons has to cross this one point in one second. And if that happens, then we can say the current is 1 ampere like that. So, think about that much of electrons has to flow. That is it. Okay. Thank you.